Do you know what time it is, kids? Another Crazy Will quick tip. Today we're going to be talking about the Alexa app itself. Um, and you may wonder, well, I just talked to her, why do I have to worry about the app? Well, the app actually helps you with a lot of different things. And today I'm going to show you their new smart home feature. So that way you don't have to just use your voice. Let's say you want to just use one app to turn it off. Like for example, when my wife's asleep, I'm not going to yell at my Echo Dot to turn off things. I actually go through the app and then I have several different uh, devices. I have iHome, I have TP-Link, I have a whole bunch of different devices. So I'd have to go into each app and turn it off. Well. Amazon, which are great thinkers over there, realize that a lot of people are using this for their smart home and they actually incorporated it because you can do it through your voice. They incorporate it with the app. So we're going to go in and look at the app today and show you how it does devices where you can go in there and turn it on and off groups, which you could do groups of sets, which is really cool if you want to learn how to group things and make it all work together, which is another really good tip that we're going to cover in this area. Let's get started in this video. Let's switch over to the phone, shall we? All right, so we're going to talk about the new features in the Alexa app. So we launched the Alexa app. We're going to hit the three lines at the top. That'll open up your window. What we're going to go to is Smart Home. Once you're in Smart Home, these are the devices that I have hooked to the Smart Home. What they did was they grouped them as devices. So now I could go in there and you have an on off. Um, or if it's if it's a light and it has dimming capabilities you can brighten it or you can lower it and that's what I thought was really nice about this is that they actually added smart functions to the device so now you could just all get this all in one area look for your device and do it uh, another thing, I know I've talked in my other videos about groups. This is a really cool thing. You can make groups of devices. If you hit add group, you know, you could do multi room or you could do smart home. Um, we'll click on smart home and you can click any of the, uh, you can make the own name of what you want. I always name it whatever I want and you can make your own groups. And when you go in there let's let's create a group just to show you we, when you go in here and you name it let's we're going to call this one high we're going to hit next but let's just go back down to devices so now like if i want to command when i say hi and when i say hi i mean i'll be saying alexa hi uh turn on high or turn on uh turn off high you pick a group of devices so like if i put you know let's say desk lights and front door and hit save that's now a group so if i say to alexa hi it'll turn on my desk lights and uh... my front door so um... we're actually going to get rid of that alright I mean, this is a good way to show you how to delete them hit edit and then delete and are you sure you want to delete high? Yep, there you go. Okay, so if you go into these groups, like there's the music groups uh, everywhere, and that's several of my Echo Dots. Um, and you go into, uh, like we have deck lights, which is just, uh, that's another thing I use. I use phrases uh, in this. Uh, what I mean is if you say uh, turn on deck light or you say turn on deck lights, sometimes she can't differentiate what you're saying. So what I do is I just make a group and then just put that name in there. And that really helps. But um, we have one. I'm home. So we'll look at this group. And now I can turn it on or off. Um, and it turns on the kitchen light. It turns on the deck lights. And it turns on the bedroom lights. And right now it is on. So I guess my wife's inside. You know, those devices are on because she's probably cleaning the house. And I'm out here making videos. So that's how you, you can make groups and you can go in there. But th the biggest thing I wanted to show you was it was cool that you can control your devices. Um, and you could turn on and off your groups as well. Another thing. Oh, I didn't check a look at this. This is all lights on. So I guess I could turn all lights on. That's pretty cool. So there's, like I said, there's a lot of c uh, control function. Um, and then scenes. Um, I haven't played too much with scenes. I mainly use scenes for as far as it is now, and you'll see a lot of TV things. That's for my Harmony 
and I am going to be making a video on that but this is just a quick overview of like you know all this is stuff that Harmony can activate um, what Harmony is is it's a uh, it's basically a remote control for your Alexa but that's all I wanted to get into and just show you how to make a group and show you how you can now control your individual devices on and off so that's it for this episode I hope this helped somebody out if it did just like and subscribe and uh, remember you can do anything you put your mind to have a good one guys you thought I was a picture didn't you Make sure you like and subscribe. Do me a favor already.